Hi Gemini, welcome to your reading and this is for Gemini Ascendant. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus placements in their chart. Jupiter may resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. Cross watchers, if I describe someone and you know that it is not you, then it is not you. Just because you are connecting with Gemini, you're going to assume that whom I am describing here is you. Please don't, this is not a personal reading. For those of you who is new to the channel, then welcome. You might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming. And in the live stream, you can ask me questions. If you miss the live streaming, then you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click the link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. And if you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. So gems, what it is that you're kind of... Someone here would love to really get this information out of their chest. Um, I can see here that someone here would love to really connect with you, but they're thinking about it. I think that this is about to happen, a confession of love. Um, someone is truly loving you, kind of really wanted to be with you here. But this person either shy of telling it to you, shy of admitting it, um, but you can see it in their actions. Sometimes this person is giving you mixed signals already, um, especially if they are being obvious, they're going to pull back. You know, they, they, they are going to pull back from, um, from showing you the emotion that is true here. Um, I can sense that this <clears throat> emotion kind of really... This is escalating. This is truly escalating. I think that as of the moment, this person is being cold to you. That is true. You know, you're missing this person. So there is separation here energetically. Um, probably this person is not communicating with you. Your heart is telling you that, hey, I wanted to start something. Um, I wanted to have victor um yeah, to have a victorious beginning with you. Kind of. It, it, it shows in the surface that this person is um, teasing you. Playing hard to get. But this is not. More of they are confused deep inside. Because they would really love to kind of divulge the information here, the love, the emotion, but someone is holding them back. So on the surface, it shows that, hey, come on, um, chase this abundance, but no, they are actually giving it to you or showing to you, but they just can't hand it over, right? I think that this person needs a little, a little wisdom, a little more of acceptance, a little more of enlightenment, you know, for them to truly accept. Um, I think that this person is the, the, the reason why they are in silent right now. It be is because they wanted to really seek enlightenment. Because this person kind of, I truly wanted to be in a relationship that is long lasting. You know, I think that your person is more of a serious type, right? You might have some age gap between you both. Um, could be you is a little older. They could be the little uh, the the older one. If this is not, I mean, roles can be changed here. If this is not an age gap, then someone thinks immaturely. Someone thinks mature. Um, but one thing's for sure: this person kind of would really love to be in a relationship for long lasting. Um, this this person is kind of not really into engaging into temporary commitment. So 
they're probably thinking right now, is this the person for me long term? Is this the person for me that I'm going to have you know, a family with and um, you know, be old with? They're kind of really in deep thought right now. You know, I think that they're also waiting for a person, someone like you. So it's kind of like an answered prayer to them. But it's kind of, is it really in front of me? Yeah, they, they, they are more of isolating themselves. Do not want to do do not want to talk yeah because in their mind they're really thinking of marriage cohabitation proposal marriage what more can we ask with the four of wands right this is more of stability getting married being in a same house building a family right which depicts most of the cards here so they are kind of really thinking in deep thought um kind of really understanding studying this kind of connection um is it really you there somehow i can feel here in, in their mind you know nothing kind of you already met their expectation you are the epitome of the right partner for them right they're placing you in a pedestal already but they are not really showing you because they are very strategic on how they're going to do it uh, with the Seven of Cups in here. Yeah, giving you some mixed signals here. That is true, right? To the point where in, they kind of turn their back in this connection, right? The love is so strong. The love so strong and they can take it anymore. Um, they, they, they kind of, probably this is the first time that this person um, experienced this kind of emotion, right? They turn their back here. Um, this is so whimsical. Um, I, I, I'm just reading this in, you know, in fairy tale movies. But I can see here that they are going to return. Um, they're just really having a hard time to express their emotion here. I think that you are also mad at them. It felt like to me that you, you feel that they're just teasing you playing playing with you right but no um they just can't say yet how they truly feel and with all fairness to them they're also having a hard time um you know accepting that they are also putting some weight on their shoulders here but sooner or later the six of wands right an announcement is going to be um, divulged or the, the, this is, the, the announcement will be going to be offered by this person with the justice um, Wow they truly truly love you but in the surface it it may feel like or it appears that they are just playing around let's check here for some messages from the book of answers no matter what no matter what they are going to show no matter what it you know no matter what it is in the surface they truly truly adore you that is true so the signs here can be a placement in your chart your person sun sign or a placement in their chart um we have leo um leo taurus Leo, Pisces, Pisces, Leo, right? Libra, Aquarius, Virgo, Pisces. So this is your reading. If you relate, if this reading resonates with you, Write down in the comment section. If you have some questions with this reading or have some personal questions, there's a link in the description box. Click the link. You will be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. If you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. So, gems.
Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you on the next reading. Goodbye, Jim.